Welcome to the StealthWatch tutorial series. My name is Dave Bush, and I'm a technical solutions architect for StealthWatch at Cisco. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to detect internal Telnet traffic in StealthWatch. Before we begin, let's review the benefit to your enterprise in using StealthWatch to detect internal Telnet traffic. Telnet is a clear text protocol, so anyone with access to your network could use a packet capture program to grab sensitive usernames, passwords, and other information found in Telnet traffic. Implementing a custom security event to check for internal Telnet traffic takes just three steps. Number one, open the web interface for the StealthWatch Management Console and click on Configure Policy Management. Number two, Click on Create New Policy and select Custom Security Event. And number three, create a rule that looks for Telnet activity on your network. First, give your Custom Security Event a name. For example, I'm going to use Telnet Traffic. You can also give it an optional description, such as Telnet Traffic Detected. Next you want to click the plus underneath find and look for subject host groups. Here you're going to set this to inside hosts because that's where we want to monitor traffic. Next you're going to uh, click plus again and select uh, subject ports protocols to search for that. You can just type ports and that will come up right here. We're going to set that to equal 23 TCP which is the port for Telnet. Now to make sure that we have bi-directional traffic, we want to set subject and peer packets both to be greater than or equal to three to make sure that there was truly bi-directional traffic. To do this, we're just going to search for packets and we're going to add subject packets and we're going to add peer packets. In both of these, we'll just do greater than three We also want to look for orientation as uh, being set to server. So we'll set, uh, click on subject orientation, choose this, and select server. Now your custom security event is complete. You'll want to click the status to from off to on, and then click save. And your custom security event for Telnet should now be active. If you're interested in evaluating StealthWatch, sign up for a test drive at cs.co slash stealthwatchtd, or you can learn more at cisco.com slash go slash stealthwatch. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe.